Welcome back YouTube, carrying on with the tail end of Final Fantasy 16, approaching the end, we're 81% of the way through the main story. Although there do be side quests, including one ahead of us, and the main port of call today is testing out the Odin powers we got last time. And it's after my day off as well, so I've been waiting longer between sessions before I get to test them out. I remember how they work though, more or less. I'm building up to the, the ultimate it's Omni Slash. <laughs> Surprised they didn't break into the sprint but it's because this is all counting as a town even though it's deserted. <laughs> hidden chest? It seems ideal for a hidden chest. Nope, never mind. That's convenient. That's what those are for. You were right, Joshua. Could you be more specific? What was he correct about? Start down for the king is gone, our nation in ruins. <laughs> what becomes of us loyal pawns now, sworn to a shattered throne? Fuck Wallowed, <laughs> fuck the dead king and his god, <laughs> fuck this withered shithole. <laughs> Well, there goes the monetization on this one. Do not affect you. You are a bearer, albeit one who's lost his brand. Pray, hear me, brother. Will you grant this pawn his final wish? Will you lay my dying soul to rest? Of course. What do you need? Some luck beyond the castle walls towards stone here there is a forest never turn my parents are buried upon the bluff nestled amongst the trees theirs was the only love I ever knew I was torn from them in life but perhaps I can return to them in death take my ring See that it rests beside their bones. May you find peace at last. Well, since it's on the way. Yeah, there's... The Empire has some army, and every nation has a little bit of an army except this one which has a lot. Because they teamed up with Beastmen. And they're all Akashic. Oh no, I think I see evil Chocobos. Beastman Cobbles, perhaps? Don't tell me. The only way to the capital is through that gate, just as you surmise. There's an army down there, Joshua. Yes, but I don't see any dominance. It's 
the quest objective through the gate as well. Oh, it's quite far in. Okay. Isn't every leader dead? No. Not every dominant was the leader of their respective nation. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Low damage, but I presume high stagger. Oh yeah, that needs lots of enemies around, I forgot. I'd fire swords. Now I know I don't need to go down here, but that makes me all the more curious what's down here because it could be like one of the locations for one of the marks. nothing here to do right now we're definitely getting sent here later oh some more amber nope, can't even climb the ladder what a group of standing enemies what's that over there Oh, it's got a unique counter. Did a lot of damage, that's pretty cool. Oh, I can just, I can leave it out even if I've used it. Parry really easy with it too. Stagger damage that is so little. Oh, the level stays charged, even if you change icons as well. Interesting. did that. You know, I was thinking about post-game stuff the other day, it would not surprise me if they did a Leviathan DLC. Because Joshua said it was like the Lost Icon. Or something, or the Lost Dominant, whatever. They could do a DLC that's based around whoever the Dominant of Leviathan is do it across the sea where the king came from, you know, something like that.
Oh. Oh, that's how you do it. That's his charging attack. Oh, that's what it could be as well, but new dominants are born, so they could still do it. Oh, it's treasure all over the joint. Just jump on ten hex. All right, time to actually push forwards. I think that's all the treasure down there for now anyway. Oh. Were they cloaked? Every damn sinew language. Remember rightly, the upgraded version of that skill goes to level 5, which I bet looks very cool. Per hit, it does not do a lot of damage, so I do think it's it's based around countering and, and parrying and stagger. Because it's not doing as much as my normal strikes, like not even close. Those do a lot though. Oh, my beastman jumps. Wait, how do I make that attack hit with multiple people? I'm willing to test more. Pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna to need to read the description of that one again. If there's more enemies, that means there's a chance for it to do its cool stuff. Uh, let's see. Not that one. Not that one. So this one. Strike forwards, can execute multiple times in succession if the previous hit lands. Ah, so you have to press it over and over, as long as the first hit lands. Oh, the, the hit landed there and it didn't work. Oh, 
There we go. You have to really spam it. They did say there was an army, I suppose. All this is for us. I wouldn't put it past all tonight. He's made nothing easy so far. So much damage. I hate that that Kens is attacking you from behind. No, that didn't do that much stagger damage. Nice try. You call that lightning? This is lightning. Hello, Polyemi. You actually got the email I was live? Oh god, there's even more. That's rare. They have a chunk. And a lot of dogs. Quite a lot of ability points for that.
We can rest here if you like. No, we can't. Don't that worry. weapon's haunted. I'll be fine. How many ability points do I need to get the alt? 1845. Okay. Hello, Jolly Jelly. It's like a big rock to me. Well, we're fighting something here. This is too open. No? Okay, we have to head into the forest to do the side quest. It does look like it could be made of, like, candy sugar. Interest. Oh, that charges Entsuken as well, actually. Doesn't seem to be any reason to have done that. Unless hidden chest? Oh, never mind. 
Yeah. Keep on hoping it says or the calcum. saying don't go this way which makes me want to go it more Oh, there's a fight in there. Look at that. It's just one room. <clears throat> yeah, that's a nasty fight in there, whatever it is. To the other side, just more enemies. Yeah, it's probably a chest over there, but meh. No villages, no knights, not even any bodies. One could almost believe the whole kingdom had turned to Kashik. It's very much like that area before the Golden Throne in Elden Ring. ourselves a teleport or a quick travel point I mean so there do be a coral in the field let me sneak close enough to see if it's got a unique sounding name oh it must be a mark it's Beigel! I wish I was at full health. That's no ordinary curl. I hope it's not going to do this the entire fight, otherwise it's going to be a real bad one. <laughs> Jordan is and it's no good against him.
This will get him though. Oh, uh, Joshua did his death beam as well. Nice. That was well timed. I did, yeah. Uh, EVP asked his, his friends. He's getting one other person to check to make sure, but it just seems to be like an outdated keyword that doesn't do anything. Let's hope it's the last of its kind. Now, how do I get around to this tree? Or grave or whatever. There's quite a few words like that where apparently they're only good for certain objective cards. I, I must have just not seen the objective card that particular keyword was used for. I didn't see any that mentioned the the prayer keyword. are making it hard to see. Going well. Uh, where is this graveyard? Oh, although I saw something up here as well. No, it's just a bomb. My God, GC. Know where I got that gill from. I'd rather have ability points. Oh! Clutch mine used in. I think I remember seeing that as one of the things we needed. Well, let's inspect this, why not? One of the one of his parents was seriously called C Nut. Sometimes dead is better. Not allowed to scare my way down the side of the cliff. I'm trying not to have to murder flying enemies because they're a pain in the ass. You've got to hit them with charged up magic or they don't fall. Well, 
like 300 to go before we can get uh, the whatever the alt is called. Uh, that's different looking raptors up there. And we've got a settlement with a giant over there. Like they've filled this field with all the like higher tier enemies. And then also raptors. There's a church up there or something. Yeah, in there. Bad back conservatory. Bad back? It's me! I mean, these are probably places that side quests are going to send us, but I am still curious to have a little gander. I think he was stuck on the scenery, that's why he didn't join in the fight. I held it. Oh, a little lizard thing. Looks like an iguana. We're definitely getting sent here for a side quest. This it seems too like prominent to just be nothing. I'm gonna head over and check the chapel as well, just in case, because it could just be a location of one of the marks we haven't killed yet. Does it bother you that we haven't heard a single human sound? Everything about this place bothers me. Let's get there. Potion, brother. And they do be sprinting. Yeah, 
Yep, I have all the particle effects now. Well, technically not. I haven't unlocked every ability. Not yet, anyway. Soon, TM. And oh, they're just on a little patrol. Oh no, they're down here. Exactly the smoothest way. Oh, I think the only way through is there. Or those clutch mine things. Does look like the location you could fight something. Many story things it could do in a place that's drowning in ether. I wonder if an NPC will send us to this graveyard to do something because they can't enter it. Well, there is loot. Hmm. I'm giving a Marge Simpson-esque to the quality of that loot. I'm sure we'll be back. I see another teleport. Um, well, fast travel point. Torgo locked eyes with another dog. It was over from the start. Finish. 
finished. I hate that they all have that one free to use sound effect of a dog yelping or whining. Oh, there's a lot of beastmen there. It's just more beastmen up there. The calm before the storm. There's only one way into that city. Across the bridge. Through the main gate. Right into the midst of whatever is left of the late king's army. Are you ready for this? As ready as I'll ever be. Now, will there be side quest icons? No, surprising. Okay, I'm going to quickly nip back though, because that should have given us enough renown to get the next reward. And it has to be almost done, reward wise. So close. Thirty-five. Come again. I may have more for you. How are you doing? Anything catch your eye? No, I've done all the side Always quests. Something in there. How many of these marks worth thirty-five? I mean that one is, but I'm sure that one's scary. Twenty, fifty, sixty, forty-five, fifty. Yeah, these are all nasty. That one's not, but it isn't. No, I guess we could go try that one. That one's not worth quite as much. Half comb and wallowed, which is where we are, or where we're questing. I guess we can try that. I'm just going to check upgrades real quick. you to upgrade my shit. I have nothing that needs. Not nothing here either. No, my gear is as good as it possibly can be unless yeah. I find all the materials. Fine. Hello, Duduk. Um, you were here when we played on Sunday, right? So I haven't really done much. Fought my way partway to the capital, that's about it. We're still on the same quest. Ooh, I have enough. 
Yeah, low damage, medium stagger. Okay, let's equip that. I think I want that to be... I'm not really keen on that one. It's got the same stats as it anyway, so... Let's try Dancing Steel instead of that. Obviously I want both those skills upgraded, but... I'm not sure if there's enough game left for that until we're in post stuff. So I'm technically handicapping myself using that right now, because if I was using Shiva it'd be better. But Odin looks cooler. Shrieks of Manus, we're in Bodborn again. Steel. I mean, the animation is a lot more thorough, so presumably, yeah. Something's going to spawn. It's an arena! Cleric Beast? Oh, Behemoth!
god, the animation keeps going. I don't know when to dodge. Let him dodge. Well, thank you, Pithy, for resetting the Twitch Prime. Appreciate it. Sorry, a mid boss fight. <laughs> and cuts. Oh god, it's Monster Hunter all over again. We didn't do enough damage. Hide right behind a rock.
Yeah, I am aware I had three health. I have no idea how my health got so low, but I am aware I had three health. Also, there must be something cinematic because he ain't dying. He's going to spam this, I might actually heal him. Oh yeah, there we go. Eh, I didn't need to heal. It really was just the hunt that they added to Monster Hunter with Behemoth. Oh, that's for different equipment. That isn't for any of the endgame recipes. Interesting. Quickly, before we're cut off for good. If it is like the others. The entrance to the Inner Sanctum will be at the foot of the crystal. We're almost there. Hmm, interesting, the corpse state. Feels like uh, just an area you'd walk into in dark. Oh no, Demon Souls actually. It feels like you're entering the the castle courtyard. the legs just spinning like crazy behind me. I will teleport back to see what the behemoth stuff makes, but I want to find another checkpoint first. Definitely another arena down there. I presume this gate's not opening. How do we get through that? You could destroy it very easily. You're both quite powerful. This gate here is open. I remember when I had Shiva powers, and then they gave me swords. No, oh, most of the enemies are in the air. I wasn't getting props. Screw you. Map. 
There's another map. They're just gonna miss. Oh, got him a little bit. Ooh, that could be enough to upgrade one of the abilities. Uh, not the ult, but I could upgrade the. Flash Slice, what does it do when it's upgraded? Number of times the ability can be chained. I think I'd rather hold off to make the out bear. Yeah. Because it already almost lasts enough to guarantee a level 3 charge. As long as you're hitting enough people. So we'll see. down there. Yeah, that's closed. They've forgotten that they can just easily destroy gates, I guess. As is video game tradition. There's a few beastmen through here. No By a few. <laughs> oh, it's a cannon Akashi catch then. Oh, you have to fully charge that to make it work. This is basically like we're in one of the fallen ruins because it is just combat room after combat room. Once we step onto that bridge, we'll be easy targets. Easy targets from what? Then we better move quickly.
Ooh, good boy. Come on, man. What are you waiting for? Hey, did you all see that this reminded me because this guy's punching a lot? Did you see that they added Doomfist to Team Fortress 2? They added Saxon Hail and he doesn't have a gun. He just punches and he has like a flying super punch and a big ground slam. I think it's a special mode because he's ridiculously powerful and you need like a whole team to fight him while one person plays his head. That took the whole second bar when I cancelled it there. That's rough. I mean every mode in TF2 is a VS mode, right? Well no, the man versus machine mode wasn't. Through the castle then. I don't see any other way. Still no checkpoint, huh? Since there's no map, it doesn't seem like there will be, either. This castle sucks. Okay, that makes one of Bahamut's abilities better. I think that's on the rare side. Yeah, this castle's aesthetic is definitely Souls game. Just everything about it. It just looks like every castle from every Souls game. Specifically Demon Souls, but especially also Dark Souls 1. The Demon Souls remake is like one to one almost. Don't need to have a creepy laugh. Well, Odin's dominant had a creepy laugh. I'm sure we'll be hearing lots of creepy laughs once the, uh, the villain starts monologuing. Oh, this is another big fight. Weaker than the one we fought outside on the way in. Damn, wasn't quite quick enough to get it in.
I need more ability points. Not super rare meteors. That can't be his ship, didn't his ship? That must be a different ship, it just looks like the Black Galleon. Because the Black Galleon's at the bottom of the ocean. This is going to be guarded. No? No? Okay, I was wrong. I expected enemies to teleport in before or after I got to the chest. There's stairs here? Yeah. This might take a while. Kicking orc so hard he exploded? Yes, once. Oh, it was only the one wave? I expected like two or three waves. Oh well. Very large area and a big gate. That's not good. Two ninja assholes. I hate these guys.
fast. Uh, get an animation, Clive. I don't think you need HP either, honestly. I think I've got this under control. Take a lot of cuts. That team deserves another. Ooh, a lot of ability points there. That might be enough to upgrade the ult. Joshua. I'm summoning a freight. Stop, Clive. You mustn't. 
We still have a long way to go. If you tap your strength here, you'll have none left to destroy the heart. Then you'd rather die? Oh no, Botsky and Sentient has come to help. She still has powers. Surprised to see us. How did you? Gav. He told us exactly where you'd be. Even sniffed out a crack in the castle wall. And when we saw the heavens come crashing down, we had no choice but to believe him. <laughs> it's been quite a day. <laughs> to what do we owe this honor? A debt I would see repaid. Prince Dion. It's good to see you well. So, this must be Ifrit. Your uncle bade me give you a message. Listen to your heart, and guide your steel true. Your father would expect no less. That is all. Thank you. For everything, Your Highness. Dion, please. You do realize the only thing we've freed so far is this wall from its foundations, right? You know, if your lord and ladyship's uh, quite finished. <laughs> well said, Gaff. We have work to do. Supposes how I can say to make you change your mind, so I'll just tell you to stay safe. It seems like potentially a point of no return. To losing the best customer, especially after letting us carry all this stuff all the way to Ash. Yeah, okay, Father just said the same thing. Man. You mean you'll buy some of offers? I've got some good stuff for you. Defender, yeah, it's still not as good as what I've been using because I've, I've been getting everything. Less HP, but a tiny bit more health. Eh. If I'd been wearing those, I would have died during the behemoth fight. Now, let's see what All I can pick the big hammer. Ever dark. Like, what are the behemoth bits used for? Oh, there, no, that's Herboros. Upgrading, maybe? Oops. Hey. You don't want me to make yours out else? Yeah, I can't bring up like a local map, so if it is a point of no return, I don't think I'm allowed to leave, am I? I know I am. Don't really have a reason to. But... You see, Clive, we're not alone. If we are to win the day, we must all play our part. And ours. Ours lies beyond those doors. Well, if this is the point of no return, we've only been going for an hour thirty, so I, I presume the finale is going to take longer than half an hour, though. But either way, we fought long and hard for this moment. Sid's dream, our dream, 
is within our grasp. Oh, grass. I need to check ability points. We need only endure this final trial, and we shall together. You all know what it is that awaits us beyond this gate. And we shall face it together. Aye. Mm. Aye. Our hosts would rather we remain. I will stay them. We will stay them. Go. Just don't keep us waiting. <coughs> Thank you. You still don't want Gooch to do it? Gooch could probably take multiple behemoths. Stay behind anyway, so <laughs> don't make me do a fallen run. Don't make me do a fallen run. Seem we are trapped. And the only way out is through Ultima. We find him and we leave. Interdimensional rifts. Alright, not a fallen ruin. Quickly checking ability points while I remember. Oh Christ, it's... Oh, we know. No, it's fine. I was looking at the wrong one. We're not quite there yet, but we will be soon. Significantly increases the number of hits. Yeah, that's the one I want.
When the world was still young, we visited upon it a miracle, magic, and in its light did all life flourish. Yet the price for this boon would prove heavy. A pall descended upon the land, painting the horizon black as night. Though we labored to forestall its spread, in this one endeavor, we stood powerless. And so we fled, that we might endure, endure, that we might discover a means of salvation. But if it was magic that caused the blight, what of the Mother Crystals? I expect he'll tell us soon enough. Were the mother, mother crystals to absorb all the ether so that humans couldn't use them? Because it was magic that was causing the blight? Is that the, the twist? He was actually trying to help? And then got nuts because nobody listened? I don't think that's the case. He seems too megalomaniacal, but I guess we'll see. This is definitely the here's the real story section. Salvation, alas, was not readily to be had. First we would require a land unvisited by the stain of corruption. An unprecedented journey lay before us. One beyond the limits of our fleshly bodies. And so we cast them off. Thus stripped to our very spirit did we find our new paradise. A land as pure as driven snow. Valisthea. There would the true work begin. For the black crept yet behind us. And soon did we arrive at a solution, the illness having spread to every organ. There was but one escape from this fate, to start afresh. With a new world, the one for which Barnabas labored, a paradise free from the blight where his god awaits, Forfeit our wills and abandon everything we hold dear. Humanity can join him. So, Ultima would have us follow in the footsteps of the king. And follow we shall. For now. I like the little tune just going in the background right now. To forge a new world would require not only power, but a constitution strong enough to wield it. Acquiring the first would be simple. Untouched by the blight, Valisthea was replete with ether, and we had only to place jewels in her crown to claim it. Acquiring the second, however, demanded creativity. 
And so I cast forth the seeds of humanity. You created us. Is that not what gods do? We sowed the seeds for you, Muthos, all that you might one day blossom. And our future thus secured, we thought to slumber, though that would prove a grave mistake. For it was as we slept that man committed his greatest sin. He awoke. Alone in a world bereft of his god's radiance, he stumbled blindly, desperate for guidance. Finding no light, he sought to kindle his own. And from that single errant impulse was his will born. Having discovered himself at last, man turned his eyes inward and found he desired evermore that which only magic might afford. So wars were waged and brothers slain for custody over that dwindling resource. And the land, she wept tears of black. He would condemn us for this. Surely he cannot be so blind to his own hypocrisy. Not blind, just... They're pulling a Prometheus. We met our god and he hates us. But we are one and the same. sin is wanting to survive, then you are as marked by it as we are. The fault is yours. Our wills were born because you abandoned us. And now, you would have us forfeit them. All for a place in your new paradise. Do you imagine yourselves worthy of one? Mankind has no place in our world. Is this truly so difficult to comprehend? We only ever require you, Muthos, when the time comes to bid this wretched realm farewell. 
None shall follow. None shall remain. What do you mean, none? This is our world. Once the land's rebirth is complete, humanity will have served its purpose. Why would we continue to suffer that which has caused us so much vexation? Because the land doesn't belong to you. It belongs to us all! What? That is where you are mistaken. You own nothing but your precious will. Brother. I can't do this alone. And you don't have to. I grow weary of your descent. Now you must learn that this master will not tolerate disobedience. That's not the form I was expecting. survive. This world may be flawed. It may be broken. But it's all we have. And if we can't share it, I see only one other choice. You have to go. You may have created us, Ultima. Time we lived on our own terms. This isn't your world anymore. It's us. Bow down, offenders. Hearts disdain. I kept going, huh? are bidding against each other on eBay. Right. Such foul attaint may not be sublimed through game standing. Only with heads hung low is penance paid. 
Event Horizon. Actually, you can do that. I was on this one.
I'm sure there'll be more to it than that, though. At last, for countless generations, have we awaited this moment. Your struggles have made you strong, yet your soul remains heavy with sin. Absolution is nigh. Repent, and all shall be forgiven. Wow, Joe doesn't have anyone, so she's only talking to herself. That's sad. Tell me, Clive. How many lives have you saved since taking my name? Fewer than we have ruined. Wherever we go, we leave a sea of tears in our wake. These... These are the wages of your will, son. What good are our choices when all they ever bring, all they will ever bring, is death? There's no atoning, Clive. No matter how hard you try. So why not leave it all behind? Leave it all behind. Please, Hello, baby. won't somebody save me? Won't anybody love me? I yearn, yet still she is not mine. Have I not given enough? From will is born desire, and it is this which consumes you, rendering you incomplete. Do you not see how the world bends and warps under the weight of your hungering hearts? What if it could all just go away? Just go away.
this is real. Wake up. It's time to go home, Clive. Clive. That's right. You're my brother. Brother? Once more, lest you forget. <laughs> My name is Clive. Clive Rossfield. Look, Ultima. Even here, the light of the vessel's will cannot be quenched, and the phoenix, his trespass should not have been possible. Not possible unless... Unless he has been with Muthos all along. The mark of the phoenix emblazoned upon his heart, made manifest by the power of will alone. Oh no, was Joshua actually dead the whole time? The power of creation. Can it be? Are their wills truly so potent? Are you still talking? I still think there's going to be more to it than that. What 
What are you talking about? In the halls of origin, does our true power quicken. And there shall you be made complete. Soon, Muthos, soon you will discover how little you know of suffering. Yeah, that is the last place we saw him up there, isn't it? Technically. And so the crystals are no more. Yet in their silence, a new song rings. Its chorus building. A crescendo as it enters its final movement. Stirring those long a slumber to waking and back to their origin. He's pulling an Age of Ultron. Crystals cracked. So where the hell are they? Oh, fuck me. Is that ether? What in good Grieger's name is going on? This is wrong. Are we back? Clive! Joshua! Jill! Is everyone all right? We're fine. What happened? Too much to explain here. Nate! We're leaving! Now! Everyone, fall back to the ship! I will be with you and none. Thank you. I don't even remember a life tree from Final Fantasy IX. <clears throat> it seems weird that we're going past like the, the thing to get home, but sure. And it seems like there might be one more dungeon. I need to 
tell everyone what happened at Drake's spine. And I'm going to need Otto's help. There's something about it. Okay, yeah, that goes on a lot longer. <laughs> Although ideally I need to upgrade this. I didn't realise it was 5,000. Oh, new crafting recipe. Welcome to the Patron's Whisper. Doing all that Sorry, didn't earn me a single bit of renown. Yet. We fought a god and won. Look at the list, do you? Is that not worthy of renown? Look. I bet there's going to be a shit ton of Always side quests after we talk to Otto. I'm going to go check the blacksmith first. Yeah, I think there's one more session in this because I don't want to rush any final side quests just for the sake of seeing the final story beats. We can always do it tomorrow. Tomorrow might be just this to get it done though. Because we're really close, we've got to be. Trouble with your gear or the same for you, dear. Oh my god, a better weapon. First Not by much, purchase, but... right? Yeah, the behemoth the recipes more. hadn't unlocked yet, that's why they weren't in there. Ooh. My best work, but it'll do. I want to check if I can craft a circle of heaven. Oh, if I had more of those clutch mines I could upgrade it as well. Oh wait no, I've got I've got the base defender, don't I? Oh wait, no, I have it, yeah. Can I buy clutch Anything mines else? from the Shop. Let me tell you a story. No, I really just want to. All right. Them rumours wet legs were spreading. Might be they weren't just tales plucked out of thin air. You see, there were a time when I weren't too particular about who I sold steel to. So yeah, long this is in relation to the side quest we did for. Some women lust after blood, others after flesh, but me. I were always one for gold. And to satisfy that lust, I sold to opposing armies, stabbed my every client in the back, made myself the most hated woman in the twins. But then one day, one day I met a man who made me a different kind of offer. Said he'd give me access to a realm wide community of like minded individuals in constant need of steel and sundries. On the condition I sold to him and he's alone. Was that the first time you met Sid? Aye. And I fell right into his damn trap. He were true to his word, so I ended up being true to mine. And I soon started making the best profits I've seen since taking up the trade. And all without aiding or abetting any outlaws. Except Sid himself, that is. He told me about his plan to topple the Mother Crystals, you know. Said that with them gone, the realm would want for all manner of things. An opportunity for the likes of me to mint gill. Why, I reckon an enterprising individual could find herself the richest dam in the twins. And that's when he had me. I emptied my stores that day and moved into the Ardaway proper. And the rest, as they say, is ancient bloody history. A dozen years on, and I'm still not the richest dam. Not for lack of trying, mind. But I can say that I have never been happier. You've all shown me there are some things more precious than gill. That there are. So don't you go messing it all up, or you'll have me to answer to. Yeah, I really just wanted to buy some clutch mines. It's a dangerous world out there. Oh, she is selling them. How many did I need? I think it was like 20, right? 20 should be enough. Not find a I actually spent gil. So, what it be? 
Uh, reinforce defender plus two. Nice. You can thank me later. Is there a defender plus three? I guess not. Anything Still, it's a neat looking sword. It's just a nice version of Excalibur, really. Still stuck here, so definitely talk to Otto at the very least. And we're gonna see all those green speech bubbles. It's gonna be that old Toy Story meme, just green, green everywhere. I'm gonna check the hunt board as well, but I'll do it after talking to him because I think that would update it. Still alive, I see. Something tells me that I saw on the horizon is your doing. How'd you manage that? It's a long story. One that I'd rather only tell once. Right. All hands on deck then. Time for a rousing speech. I'm sure you've all guessed. The crystal which now commands the eastern skies was summoned by Ultima. He called it Origin. Though the significance of that name is as yet unclear. What does it matter what it's called? Its emergence tore Twinside asunder and wiped my homeland from the map. Mention of the Dominion Spires can be found in the oldest of Valisthian records. But to the best of my knowledge, none provide any hint as to their true nature. That they would prove the horns of some slumbering demon. Well, the Dominion's demise was at least quick. Elsewhere, the Republican army cannot hope to contain the chaos engulfing Randalar. Canva is in flames, and the Empire. Our allies are crying out for answers. I've sent the curse breakers to give them what assurances we can, but right now that amounts to fuck all. They wouldn't be able to stop what the skies have started in any case. People here and across the realm grow sicker with every passing day. Could it be that this new mother crystal is like the others? That it draws upon the land's ether? It certainly looked that way, from stone here. If that were true, it would explain the hastening spread of the Blight since the Crystal's appearance. Would it not? And as the land's ether slowly rises to the surface, it pulls. Corrupting all who cannot channel its energies. Arche above. Ether floods below, and in the middle, here we languish, hopelessly entrapped. <laughs> it's all right. When we faced him at Stone here, Ultima told us his true power quickens in the halls of origin. Needless to say, we cannot allow that to continue. If we are to stop him, we will have to find a way into the crystal. How are we going to manage that then? It's up in the sky. And fast as she is, the Enterprise can't fly. <laughs> it's a lot to take in, and I reckon we'd all benefit from some time to clear our heads. They could just turn into the super if he can fly. Don't you worry. Ain't that right, Clive? Right. That's right. Well, go on then. Bugger off.
Same goes for you, Clive. You won't solve yeah, it certainly sounds like uh, go do side Trust quests for a bit type oh, moment. Fresh air, right? <sighs> Thank you. Wait for it. Wait for it. Joshua seemed upset. Oh? No green? No green here. No green? Really? That's amazing. I'm shocked. I'm gonna go check the hunt board. It still might happen. Even if there's only an hour left, I, st I don't want to try and I don't want to feel like I'm rushing through it. So we will still do one more session. But let's just see. So if you want to see the thrilling conclusion, because we'll play until we finish it tomorrow. Is the Blood Moon new? I think it is. Either way. Tomorrow. <laughs>